Welcome to the Adam Val YouTube channel. Veganuary. As and we've, continued. We've been to KFC and look, I've just noticed this as I've spun the box round. They oh, pushed that in. I didn't notice that. So they've bought out their, their zero chicken vegan burger for right Veganuary and they've pushed a the little thing at the back to show that it's to vegan. Show vegan. Right, and I will tell you now, before we go into a quick, quick little story about this, I'll tell you now what this is. This is an original recipe, corn fillet, coated in our famous 11 herbs and spices in a sesame seed bun, 11. French lettuce, vegan mayo, vegan mayo, 100% vegan. Um, it's a vegan burger the Colonel would be proud to put his name on. You show him a picture of that. It's a snapshot, I ain't got a picture of it. I've got uh, half of a picture. Yeah, look, it's, it's not really, it's not really come out very well. Look, yeah, like, but then that's the top. You ain't really gonna see it. That's not a good picture. It never, it never makes the picture anyway, does no. it? So that is said product from KFC. From KFC. Tell the story. That was three pound. How much was that? Three ninety nine. Three ninety nine, which seems expensive for a burger on its own, but they are competing against the normal fillet burger, which we looked and it's exactly the same price. Three ninety nine. So it's, they, we can't argue with them on the price really because they've gone straight against the fillet. However, when we ordered that. We waited 15 minutes from going in to KFC to leaving KFC was 15 minutes. And she even told us, the lady behind the till, staff were very knowledgeable in KFC, by the way. She, yep. she told us it was vegan mayonnaise. She told us vegan bun. She told us the coating was vegan. And they're cooked in an oven separate from anything whole else that KFC oven. make. So, so this KFC, so it's probably all of them. They all had to get like a new oven in. Mm. It was specially just to cook that. They, so they had the knowledge, but they lacked timing and there was well, a lot was, of staff there after 12 she said you've been waiting 12 minutes would you like a free drink and there was a lot of staff there i think it was a poor excuse it was a poor showing in the time delay if you're a vegan be prepared to wait we started to get a bit, we, we, we turned into a bit of a comedy double act in there didn't we we was chatting we with other customers because it was it was getting embarrassing now adam, adam said he'd, he'd shaved before he went in and he came out like that so let's have a just pull it apart because we're going to cut this in half to share so, oh, that's quite, that's quite dry at the top, isn't it? Yeah, it looks, I thought the mayo might have been on the top, because if you there's, look... There's nothing on the top. This is the corn fillet, and there's your bit of mayo there underneath on the bottom half. That top bit's dry now, isn't it? Yeah. This is quite big for KFC, because they've never released really This is anything. the first time they've done any of the not. They do do other vegan products, I noticed on the menu. They oh, do yeah. beans, sweet corn, that's all vegan. Is that all to come out today, now? No, that's just their stuff for their beans. Oh, I've okay. KFC and have beans previously, if you're a vegan. But now you can get else. a full burger... Now you can get the full the boodle. But tell them about the chips. We asked about the chips. The chips are not vegan. If you go to uh, KFC and you want vegan chips, you're out of luck. We asked about the chips. They aren't, they're, they're cooked in. They, go, yeah, they must be cooked in. Oh, look at that. It's cut quite nicely. You see, you can't have the chips. But it looks like a, a chunk of meat, doesn't it? That it looks certainly like does. a chunk of meat. And I know that corn does look like meat. I said to Val outside, I said... I want this to taste like I'm having KFC. The, I'm, I'm a, the, the bun texture's not looking... You've got to remember though, yeah, because the bun, I guess, is different. The mayonnaise is going to be different. Let's taste this. Well, there's a little bit of spice on that, isn't there? You said, before we filmed, Adam said he wants to bite it and he wants to think that he's having a KFC. Yeah. The woman in the shop told us that it isn't the same blend of herbs and spices that they use on the chicken. However, there is a bit of spice, and it's actually quite a pleasant taste. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It? it tastes like I'm having a KFC. That's the thing. Right, you've got to give them credit here. KFC, you get one of them, I think, because it does taste like I'm having a KFC. I think... I'm if, trying to taste the mayo. If you're going to say something ain't the nicest, it's probably the bun. Mm. The bun's horrible. It's, really, it's a bit dry. It's really hard to swallow. I'm trying to taste the mayonnaise to see if there's any difference. There's, that ain't made with eggs or nothing, then, is it? No. I think a lot of the mayonnaise you buy in a bottle in the supermarket aren't necessarily all egg based. Ah. <clears throat> mayonnaise is fine. The fillet bit's fine. I'm waiting that. That's a lovely, it's a lovely, lovely coating on it. Yeah. That. That's a lovely coating. Yeah, if you're just tasting that bit on its own, it don't look like a. Personally, I think they should have put mayonnaise at the top and the bottom, maybe a bit less top and bottom, because it's making the bun really, really dry. I don't think there's anything particularly wrong with the bun, but it's so dry it's hard to swallow. But that yeah. KFC taste is there, 100%. KFC taste is there, yeah. The KFC taste is there. I think if you've done that as a blind taste test, you might not necessarily know that that isn't a bit of chicken. 
I think if you've done that as a blind taste test, you're going to struggle to say that ain't got meat in it. Exactly. Uh -huh. They've done well, KFC. Yeah. Really, really well. They've, they've done well. Go and buy a KFC. If you're a vegan, go and get your KFC. And if you're not a vegan, go and get... I could have messed up made on the table. So you, you couldn't really eat the bun for jump? No, the, but I think the bun put me off, but I think it's because it was dry, not because of the type of bun that it was. It probably needed more toasting and a bit more mayo in it, but then I probably would have made it too yeah. messy. So. Yeah, if you're going to pull it up, you're saying it's a little bit dry, the bun a little bit dry. But it, at the you main said you wanted the KFC it. taste, it had the KFC taste. And I didn't think I was going to get it, and I got it, it surprised mm. me. And it's got a really nice aftertaste as well, I mean, that's nice yeah. little kick. Like nice you said nice little spicy kick there. Well done, KFC. No, you've done well. I think this would be around for a while. That gets an Adam and Val official thumbs up. 100%. I did the point, to be honest. I missed it. 